Hence, one would conclude that they not only brought with them the letter, but the meaning of those reputed cherubimical figures, which were designed to represent the inseparable attributes of Hea. Hea. It is universally agreed by the Christian's world that every religious observance of the ancient heathens which the Mosaic law approved of was at first derived from the divine appointment and as we are assured in the first pages of the sacred oracles concerning Cain in Genesis that he went out from the presence of the land, we learn that God in that early state of the world chose a place for his more immediate presence, his faces, appearance, or forms residing in or between the cherubim. We may therefore reasonably conclude from the various gods and religious worship of the ancient heathens and from the remaining divide emblems and family names of the Indian Americans that the former deduced those emblems they def def defied from the compound cherubim in paradise and that the Indians derived their cherubic figures and names of tribes from the cherubim that covered the mercy seat in the tabernacle and in Solomon's temple alluded to and delineated in several parts of the sacred oracles and that is the end of argument two stay tuned for argument three my brothers and sisters